What's up everyone? Today I am doing a video I'm actually really really excited for here in Utah and I think it's starting to become a thing kind of everywhere but cookie places are a huge thing so I'm gonna be testing them today with a special guest and we're gonna decide which one we actually think is the best. I got them from four different places they're all local around here. Um, some of them do have shops like all across the US but they all for the most part are pretty big here. I'm gonna be ranking them so like if they came on time how good they are stuff like that we're gonna see all of it and we're gonna decide which one is actually the best so here we go okay my special guest is here and it is Brooks hey. <laughs> so Brooks so this is Brooklyn's boyfriend mm -hmm. I'm sure most y'all know from the dating series me and Brooks actually live in the same like town yeah we're so like, we, we literally live like two minutes away from each other yeah we have to find out what the actual best which one is, one is the best cookie which one do you, do you think I honestly think chip is gonna be the winner I think it's kind of between I don't know I actually don't know which one's gonna be the best so basically what we did is we have one chocolate chip cookie from each place because oh, okay. Okay. And then we like called them and asked them like what their favorite flavor was or like which oh, one is I the best. You. And then they put that in the box. We forgot a knife to cut the cookies with. I brought everything, but I forgot a knife. They had a spoon. <laughs> I, I think this will work. It'll work better than nothing. <laughs> yeah. So the thing is, we um, I like tracked when I ordered them and when they got there. The first one to be delivered was Chip. So the delivery time was set for 12:30 to 1 o'clock, and it got there at 12:27. So we got there three minutes early, which okay, is pretty, pretty good. good. That it's pretty yeah. good. First thing we're gonna judge is the presentation. Here is our chip we box. Got chip. chip box. I feel like chips really like really classy in yeah, the Yeah, I was gonna say like sleek white box, gold like logo going and, on. And like if you go in the store too, like it's really just like yeah. simple, minimalistic, but it's like really cool. So so okay, go ahead and cut them. Which we'll one see. are we gonna try first? We gotta just start with like the chocolate chip, the basic. Okay. Am I cutting with the spoon? <laughs> no, do, you, do you care if I touch it? No, it's fine. Okay. I mean just <laughs> a knife would have definitely been the way to go. <laughs> so it's ten dollars for a box of four. Not which, bad. Huge like, cookies. Like some people are like, oh, you can make like so many cookies at home for like less than that. First of all, I don't really want to make cookies at home because yeah, I'm, it's like so there's like so many materials that you need and like. I and then it's like you don't have one thing, you have to run to the yeah, store to get it. It's kind of hassle. Okay, so we are ready to try it. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. I feel like this is gonna be pretty good. It looks yeah. good. Okay. I feel like it's pretty good. Yeah. I like cookies that are really soft, and I like mine a little bit undercooked. Okay. I feel like this one's good. Like, the, the top is, like, kind of crunchy, mm -hmm. but then once you bite into it, it's like, it's, like, soft. So, what do we think? What do we give the, the price? What do we rate it? One out of five. Hmm. Ten dollars. I don't know. Maybe, like... Are we gonna do like, I'm gonna say like 3.5. Okay. That's what I'd say. Like $10 for me, it's like, okay, like I can spend that. If it goes over 10, I'm kinda like, ooh. Yeah, it's like, I wouldn't wanna like spend $10 every day to get yeah. like a box of four cookies. Yeah, for you sure. You know what I mean? Okay, presentation, I feel like they nailed it. Yeah, I'd say, what are you gonna give it? I think I give it a five. Yeah. I think it's pretty good. I like the box. Even on the inside, they have like little chip paper, yeah. you know? That's the other thing with deliveries. Sometimes they get kinda like smashed or stuff. These aren't. Brooks is not good at cutting cookies. We have a spoon. <laughs> It's kind of messy. I like that one. That one's pretty good. It's a pretty good cookie. So taste, what do we think? Mm. One out of five? Maybe like close to it. I don't want to say all, but like four. Yeah. But it's like pretty close there. It's like like 3.75? Yeah, 3.75. We'll go to that. <laughs> That's kind of what I'm thinking too, because it's more than three and a half, but less than four. Wow factor. It looks really nice. Like the cookies are pretty cool. That yeah. flavor, I mean like that like seasonal one, that was like pretty good. But I don't think it's like a super like, wow, like it's not like a super cool, like it's not like some crazy exotic flavor. Like it's just yeah, butterfinger. Yeah, it's a butterfinger. I, I mean, my experience of like cookie taste testing is limited, <laughs> so. Mine too. <laughs> I definitely think that like presentation, that's like what's giving it the wow factor. Yeah, yeah, we can go with three. Three's we good. We can't do 3.5 for all of them because that's, that's like true. dead middle. I feel bad, what if one of these are like really bad we're just like, oh, one. Oh, one. Okay, we're moving on to Swig because Swig was delivered next. So, okay. Swig is $1.89 per cookie. Okay, so th that's Which cheaper is, it's than... cheaper than chip. Yeah. So, I ordered them to be delivered um, at 12.45 and they were delivered at 12.53. So, like... So, a little later. Like, eight minutes late. But, like, not, not bad, though. Not bad. It's not like we'd yeah. be waiting for them and be like, where are the cookies? What do we give, what do we give chip? Um, 3.5. 
So we go maybe a four. Four. It's cheaper. Four point five. Like a dollar eighty. I think the cookies are pretty big. Yeah, like a dollar eighty is like that's. I mean, yeah. kids would be selling it for like a dollar fifty on the side of the road if yeah. they cookies at, at a you pay, I think you like pay more for like a drink at the gas station. Yeah. So I'd give it like a four. I give it like four. It's pretty good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I do have to say I like the box. Yeah. I like the colors. The box is I pretty. It kind of has cool. like a Christmassy. Yeah, it does. And I think they're vibe. kind of moving into like holiday, and they seem like someone who would do like holiday themed boxes, which is really fun. Yeah. Sure. Some the inside though. But the inside, I am not sure I feel about that. Yeah. I don't know. I think I'd have to go to it. This is the bat, like the cookie in the it's bag. Just the it's bag. just kind of disappointing. It is. It is because it kind of like it's hard to eat. And then like you pull it out, and then half the frosting is yeah. just stick on the bag. I think I have to go with the two. Yeah. So I'll read the flavors. We got okay. chocolate chip. So the basic OG chocolate chip. We also have pumpkin cookie. We also have sugar cookie. Mm -hmm. And that's it. So sugar cookie is what they're like known yeah, for. Yeah, I like I love their sugar cookies. I'll be honest. So I'll be a little biased. Okay. Okay. Then, here's a, here's what the chocolate chip looks like. Not gonna lie. It's a little. It doesn't look as like fresh. Yeah. As the other one. Okay, ready? Okay. I do like how soft it is. I honestly think the texture is better than chips. Yeah, there's the not much taste, chocolate in it though. I don't really taste anything. I feel like it's just like a normal cookie. Yeah. I don't know if that makes sense. Like, I get it. I get it. There's, there's not no, like I like in I my bite. I think I had one chocolate chip. Yeah, I think I had one too. We should do the pumpkin. Okay. Save, save the best for last. Save the best for last. Yeah. I didn't know that they did like specialty flavors. I yeah. guess. Here's what we're talking about. When you're pulling it out of the bag, yeah, it's like all. And, and it's not out. because it's like hot or anything because it's just the it's cold like the cookies chilled Cookie wise it looks way fluffier and it looks yeah. really good. It's super like super soft. It feels almost like pumpkin bread. Yeah, okay Not what I was expecting It's like spicier. It has more like it has more like yeah spice to it. It's also bread Okay. So this is what they're known for. Like if you're going to Swig, you're getting a drink and you're getting this cookie. Yeah, that's a good sugar cookie. It is. Super soft, the icing is good. It's a really good sugar cookie. Yeah. I'm gonna finish this piece like, too. I really like sugar cookies, but this is, like if I was gonna eat one, I'd eat this. Mm -hmm. The pumpkin, like flavor-wise, I liked the flavor. But it wasn't a cookie. It wasn't a cookie. It was a little too, like, had too much spice for me. Uh, the chilled, good. Yeah, chilled was great. Like, do we just give it a straight up three in the middle? Because I'd say the chilled cookie, the ice was the And that's the what they're like known for. It was like up there. It was like four, four point yeah, five. Yeah, I'd give it mean? like four point five. But then the cookie, uh, the chocolate chip cookies, yeah, uh, like yeah. bottom. Like, yeah. Try to be rude. Say something rude. The chocolate chip cookies suck. <laughs> you can't do it. <laughs> I, yeah, I don't know. I like don't want to be mean. <laughs> Let's give it like a two. No, they did no, 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 they did better than a two. 3.25. <laughs> We're going decimals here. <laughs> okay. 3.25. I agree with that. Okay, wow. Not much wow. Like, in my opinion, I don't think there was a... That's kind of what I think. I think it's just like cookies. Like, yeah. the cookies. 1. 1.5. <laughs> That's 1. what 1. I think. 1.5. <laughs> just because I like... That sugar cookie. I liked kind of the, the, the kick and the pumpkin one. I thought that was kind of like a little wow factor. Okay, so Sweet Tooth Fairy. They have a lot of different desserts. And they... they Look at this box. We just got the cookie. Sweet Tooth Fairy, I've had some of their desserts before. They make some really good, like, brownies. They have a whole bunch of different pastries and stuff. And they have like vegan brownies and stuff like that. Presentation, what do we think? You know, like the more I look at like these other ones, the more I'm like, Chip really nailed it with presentation. Chip did you know really what I mean? Like this box is good, but then you open it and it's just like brown. I think if they had paper in the bottom, yeah, it would be like perfect because they're warm cookies. And when you put warm cookies on something, like the oils kind of yeah, get you, on you the You can cardboard. see it. You can see it like right here. But I, the cookies in general, like if I saw somebody's mom making these cookies, I'd be like, they really know what they're doing. Like those, yeah. they're fluffy. They're not too big. No, they're like perfect size. But they, de yeah, they definitely, I mean, I like that they're kind of like fluffy and like yeah. big. It's like not quite a four, but it's not like a three yeah. or something either. Are you thinking like higher three? I think like... 3.7? That's kind of Five? where I'm ending. Three and three quarters, you three, know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. Good with that? Yeah, that's good. That's okay. perfect. Let's go with that. Our spoon is still doing good. Has a bunch <laughs> of cookie leftovers on it, but it still comes strong. For an assorted six pack, it's $13.75. So that is $2.29 per cookie, which is cheaper than chip. I'd say it's like, like a four. That's a pretty solid price. Yeah. I'd give it a four. Yeah. What do you think? 
It's pretty like cookie doughy, you know? I think I it's pretty it. good. It tastes just like straight up cookie yeah, dough. Yeah, and like as you're chewing it, it kind of like fell apart yeah. more and more, you know what I mean? I actually think that's a really good chocolate yeah, chip Yeah, I like that. Like, seriously, if someone's mom like was making these at home, I'd be like, I'd be like oh heck yeah. bring me cookies every time I come <laughs> over. Okay, we have candy craze, and it looks, I'm not sure what's in it exactly. That one's way good. Whoa, what's in that? Did you get like... I feel like it's a Reese's piece. I think the Reese's little Reese's thing. It kind of tastes like a little Twix. Oh, shoot. Dude, these are good cookies. Oh, whoa. That's a pretzel. Whoa. Remember I was like, is that like a nut? I thought it was like some sort of like, like a, pe a pecan or something mm -hmm. like that. Like all of them, I really liked all of them. Yeah. Should we say... It's five? Are you going to have five? I think, I think oh, yeah, they yeah, deserve I was impressed. it. I think they deserve yeah. it. Wow gave, factor. Wow factor? That last cookie gave me that the last wow cookie factor. really. They got that one. They did. I've never really had a cookie with pretzels in it before. Mm. I wouldn't have thought of that. And I wasn't even, you couldn't even see the pretzels, no, you know? No, you can't. And Maybe like a four? Yeah. Four, I mean, like, four, that was like a pretty. Uh, what do you think? Four or four and a half? It's going four. We literally both said wow. That's true. You know what I mean? That's true. They deserve it. Four and a half. This is our last one. Okay, we got the nice little crumble box. They were supposed to be delivered um, at 1.30 and they arrived at 1.29. Oh. Okay, and crumble, it is um, $10.48 for a pack of four. Okay, not too bad. That's like, is that the, that's the most expensive one though. Yeah, that's chip was 260. 10. Yeah. So it's definitely the most expensive one. So for price, what do we give it? Like a, we gave chip a 3.5. So three? Yeah, three. Okay, I already know their presentation. Like, I'm just, I'm not having you open these yet. I'm just gonna open them, like. Okay. Cause like, they always like, I feel like they always just look good. That looks really good. Yeah, that chocolate one, oh my gosh. It smells good too. Shoot. <laughs> what do we think for a presentation? I'd give them like a five. <clears throat> chocolate chip cookie, here we go. It's good. That's a good chocolate chip cookie. It's good. I don't think it's as good as the last one, mm -mm. but it's good. Do you think it's better than chips? No, I like chips was like pretty raised. You yeah. Know? I like that. Yeah, I don't like, yeah, this one's not as like. But I think fluffy. it was definitely better than Swigs. Yeah. So it's probably sure. got third place. But they're kind of more known for their specialty flavors. So what they do is they keep, they keep um, chocolate chip in their chilled sugar one and they keep those every week and then they add in like three to four I think. Yeah, they have like seasonal specialty Yeah, but flavors. they change them every week. So it's kind of fun where it's like you could go every week and get a different experience mm -hmm. every time. Cookie number two. Okay, which one do you want to try? I kind of feel like we have to try their chilled one. Which one is the chilled one? This one? Yeah. The Twix? Yeah, so they did chilled Twix. Okay, you ready? Okay. It just tell, it tastes like a it just kind of sugar cookie. Tastes like caramel. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, not super impressed by that one. Yeah. But we'll see. Okay. I've never tried this one, so. I still it tastes like a legit chocolate. Cake, yeah, it does. But just like cookie. Mm -hmm. Like that frosting spot on. That was good. I don't know how they nailed that cake flavor so well. Yeah. This is the last cookie. The last cookie. It's still chilled. That tastes more like a cookie. That one's better than. Better than, what was it, Swig? Was it Swig? Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was Swig. Also, yeah. their frosting was like cream cheese frosting, yeah. which was good. Chocolate chip was just like a chocolate chip. Yeah. Twix was eh. Then the last two, though. The last two were good. I'd give them a four. That's kind of what I think. Because, like, chip is more known for their chocolate chip, and then yeah. crumble is more known for, for like, their, their other ones. Okay, you know I mean? wow factor. It was there for the, yeah. the cake. Yeah. Four? <laughs> four? Four? Yeah, let's do four. Okay, we have our winner. So the total points would have been 20 out of 20. Mm -hmm. So coming up in last place, we have Swig. They're known for their drinks. Their drinks is what you go for. So I don't think um, like it's that surprising, to be honest. And yeah. their sugar cookie was good. And that's what was the best part of their their whole... Yeah, everything. that's what like they so, that's what they started out with. Yeah, and it's like cheap enough where it's like you go get a drink and you go get a sugar cookie and it's like a dollar and 80 cents or whatever. It's not super expensive, but yeah. in comparison to the other cookie places, it yeah, just can't Yeah, they were kind of dis yeah. Not bad. None of them were bad. Yeah. There were just some that were really, really good. Yeah, that's, that's like the different yeah. difference between them all. Okay, in third place, we have Chip. 
Shut up. That was 15.25 out of 20. So I think it's kind of surprising though, because like chip, like it's chip. I know, it's like a. It's I think like they're the, the first ones. And their OG, like the chocolate chip one, was good. Yeah. But I think like the problem is like they didn't have a ton of specialty flavors. Like all they really carry is their chocolate chip mm -hmm. and then maybe one other one. Yeah. And so it's like if you don't like those, then you're not gonna go. You're gonna go to like Crumble or something yeah. where they change. Okay, in second place we have Crumble and it was pretty tight. Yeah. It came down pretty close. There's only a few points. Like, like a, a point and yeah. a half. So it was really close. They scored 16 out of 20. I think just their specialty flavors are so good. They do a really yeah. good job really capturing the flavor and putting it into a cookie. The presentation's nice. The cookies look so cool. Yeah, they do. They just look so pretty. And number one, we have the underdog Sweet Tooth Fairy. I, yeah. Like, I did not see that coming, to be honest. Like, yeah, I, I didn't really even I didn't even think of Sweet Tooth Fairy. People only really talk about, like, crumble and chip. Yeah. But those were good cookies. They were. Like, the, at least, like, prettiest. Like, they look good, but they're not, like, Yeah, I wouldn't crumbles. say they were, like, the prettiest when you look at them, but, like. They taste so good. They taste so good. And they are fluffy, and it was, like, cookie dough. And they are like, super thick. They are like, that yeah. big. They definitely won. They got 17. 15.25 out of 20, which is a really, really good. good score. So I'm super and impressed and full answer. of cookies. I know, I'm <laughs> so full. I'm like ready to give all the rest to my roommates <laughs> yeah. now. All right, well, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks to Brooks for coming and eating a bunch of cookies with I know, me. Anytime, yeah, anytime, anytime I want to eat cookies, hit me up. Anytime. <laughs> yeah. um, but hopefully you guys enjoyed watching this. I will see you next week, and bye. Bye.